In this class we are going to discuss excess 3 subtraction using 9's complement. See the steps here, how we will do excess 3 subtraction by using 9's complement means it is very similar to all 9's complement subtractions, but the only difference is we need to take excess 3 each time. After taking 9's complement we need to take excess 3 and after uh, taking uh, nice complement of subtrahend we need to take uh, excess 3 for mini and also when we are adding so we need to take excess 3 for mini and so see here this steps includes take nice complement for subtrahend and then we need to consider excess 3 for that nice complement and add it to the mini and excess 3 we need to take excess 3 for mini and also and we have to add 9's complement excess 3 of subtrahend and excess 3 of minuend. After addition, general excess 3 addition uh, rules will follow. That means if carry is generated, we need to add 3. Otherwise, we need to subtract 3 for specific bits. See here, for better understanding, let me take a problem that is 345 decimal minus 232 decimal. So, first we need to take the 9's complement of subtrahend and then we need to consider excess 3 code for that 9's complement. So, here our subtrahend is this and mini end is this. Now, what is the 9's complement of that 232? So, 9's complement can be obtained by subtracting each and every digit of decimal number from 9. So, 9 minus 2 is equal to 7, 9 minus 3 is equal to 6 and 9 minus 2 again equal to 7. Se 767 will be the 9's complement of 232. Now, I am not going to take 767 for excess 3. So, then you are getting 7 for 7 you need to take. 10. So, uh, that's, that means here I am taking 767. This is the 9's complement of our subtrahend. But we need to take excess 3 for this 9's complement. That means for 7 you are going to write 10. For 6 you are going to write plus 3. 6 plus 3 means 9. Again for 7 you are going to take 10. So, here the excess 3 code for this is for 7 you are writing 10, for 6 you are writing 9, for 7 you are writing 10. This is the excess 3 code you need to write. For 10, 1010, 0, 0, this is excess 3 code for 7. For 6, the excess 3 code you need to write as 1001. Next for 7, again 7 plus 3 means 10, that means 1010. 0, 0. So, okay, we take a 9's complement of 232 that is as 767 and then as we are doing excess 3 subtraction, we need to take excess 3 code for that 9's complement. We take an excess 3 code for that 9's complement of subtrahend. Then our second step is mini and excess 3 we need to add for this. So, our mini and is 345, 345. For this, you need to take excess 3 code and then you need to add these two. So, here for 3, what is excess 3 means 3 plus 3, 6. For 4, excess 3 means 4 plus 3, 7. For 5, excess 3 means 5 plus 3, 8. So, 678 will be the excess 3 code for our mind and 345. So, see here, I am writing 6, 0, double 1, 0 and for 7, so 0, triple 1 is 7 and then for 8, for 8 means 1, triple 0. So, I take an excess 3 for 345 as 678 in excess 3 code. Now, our step is to add it to my near. So, for this I am going to add this excess 3 of mini end. So, see here 10 plus 8. So, means 18. So, 18 means it will exceed 16. So, see here 
0 plus 0, 0, 1 plus 0, 0, 1 plus 0, sorry 1. So, here 0 plus 0, 0, 1 plus 1, 0 with carry 1. Here you generated a excess 3 carry. Okay, keep it aside and now you just see here 1 plus 1, 0 with carry 1, 1 plus 1, 0 with carry 1. 1 plus 1, 0 with carry 1. Finally, 1 plus 1, 0 with carry 1. So, see here, this is 9 and this is some 7. Means, it is going to be 16. 8, 4, 2, 1, this one is 16 here. In this case, this is equal into 16 plus 2, 18. 10 plus 8, 18. 18 means, this is 16 place. This is 2's place. This is nothing but 2 powers. 2 power 0, 2 power 1, 2 square, 2, power, 2 cube and 2 power 4. 2 power 4 means this is 16's place and 2 power 1 place means 2. 16 plus 2, 18. Like that directly also we can write. So, whatever it may be. So, here this is 10 and this is 6 again. So, 10 plus 6 means 16. So, see here. So, 0 plus 0, 0, 1 plus 1, 0 with carry 1, 1 plus 1, 0 with carry 1, 1 plus 1, 0 with carry 1. Same thing you are going to get. 16 means in 16 place only you are getting 1. But why we are taking that as carry means you added 4 bits with 4 bits, you got 5 bits. That's why whatever 1 you got in 16 place that you are taking as extra bit or carry bit. Now our step is if carry is generated follow up that carries to the next bits. Specially please keep in mind while doing BCD addition or BCD subtraction after addition of subtrahend or minion after addition of two bits if carries are generated that carries are follow up in last step. But in case of excess 3 addition or subtraction, if carries we are having, we need to follow up that carries in first step itself. This is the main difference between BCD subtraction process and excess 3 subtraction process. After addition of our subtrahend and minor end, in BCD, you are taking correction first, but in excess 3, you are going for carry follow up. Whereas in BCD, carry follow up will be taken in last step. So, this is the main difference. So, see here, if I generated any carries, now the next step is to follow up the carries. So, see here, we are in nines complement. We know uh, in all odd complements, and around carry is added to the result. In case of even complements like tens, twos and sixteens, we are going to discard the carry, but as we are in one of the odd complement that is nice complement, this end around carry is added to the result. As we are doing subtraction, when you are in subtraction, end around carry is not at all taken as next bit, we need to add to the result. In any subtraction, end around carry is there, that not at all taken as next bit. After addition, if you got any end around carry, then do not treat that as next bit. Either you have to add to the result or you need to discard that carry depending upon the complement we are in. As we are in odd complement, we need to add this carry to the result. Okay, we will do follow up of this carry. So, I am follow uping this carry to here and next I am follow uping this carry to here. And I am giving this end around carry to the result. In the same step, I am giving this end around carry to here. So, see here, 1 plus 1, 1. Here you are having 1, 0, 0. This bit is over and corrected. So, now it needs some correction in the next step. So, see here, 0, 0, 0, 1. After adding 1, after adding 1, here also 0, 0, 0, 1. So, you follow up the carries. But you need to keep in mind about correction. Whatever the bits you got carries, for that bits you need to add 3. For the remaining rest of bits you need to subtract 3. So, see here. So, now 
and around carry is generated means result is always positive and now you need correction for this bit which came from previous it got carry means it needs correction of addition of 3 I am adding 3 for this so this bit this came from previous means from here so this is also got carry that means it also needs correction by addition of 3 now here also you got carry in previous step so you need addition of 3 for correction so now I add I am going to add 3 plus 3 that means you are going to get 6 here 0 double 1 0 and then here 1 plus 3 that means you are going to get some 4 here and then here also 1 plus 3 you are going to get same 4 here so this is the result you are going to get by using 9's complement excess 3 subtraction what you got here means 44 and 6 446 you are getting as excess 3 subtraction result now we will compare what is the actual result and whether this is correct excess 3 subtraction result or not by using 9's complement now we will see so here 345 minus 232 345 minus 232 what you have to get here means 5 minus 2 so this is 3 4 minus 3 1 3 minus 2 1 your actual result is 113 113 but as you are doing excess 3 subtraction the result is also be in excess 3 form so here for 1 what is the excess 3 means 1 plus 3 4 for 1 what is the excess 3 means 4 for 3 what is the excess 3 means 6 this is the excess 3 of this is the excess 3 of 113 can we say like this yes we can say like this so this is the excess 3 of 113 so whatever result you got as excess 3 of actual result that is exactly right by using excess 3 nines complement subtraction this may comes under excess 3 nines complement subtraction of smaller from larger number in different case like larger from smaller you won't get this carry here so you just follow up the carries in middle steps and in correction if you are not getting carry to this bit then you are subtracting 3 from that and at final whatever result you are getting there that will be in nice complement form in case of larger from smaller case in this case you are getting end around carry means so no problem at all result is in normal form so just in normal form means just in excess 3 form if you are not getting enter and carry means the result is in nice complement excess 3 form. So, this is the difference between smaller minus and larger and larger minus smaller case also. So, in the same way we can perform any smaller from larger subtraction by using excess 3 nice complement subtraction process.